to tell you all that today is a National Library Shelfie Day. All right, Library Shelfie Day or Bookshelf Shelfie Day, it's one or the other. So here is the deal. Here is the expectation that you're going to go to your library, go to your library. Hopefully you all have a library at home. Every week I'm sharing with you a book. So I'm assuming you are accumulating books, but maybe you're using, you know, Goodread and your, your, your shelf is digital, possibly. Um, for those of us who still like to touch a book, uh, then, you know, we have our bookcases. Uh, you take a picture with the hashtag National Shelfie Day. Oh, look, I should look at the slide so I can tell you all what it actually says. But that that's that's the point of that. And so I thought that was so cool. But yes, National Shelfie Day. And so take a, take a picture of your bookcase, of your bookshelves, and share. And furthermore, um, the suggestion is, because this was created by, uh, I forget when, but it was created by the New York Library. And so the whole deal was um, the libraries do special shelving arrangements. Can you like geek out just for just a moment? The libraries do like their own like shelving arrangement on National Shelfie Day and you can go in and see what arrangements they have. So some people like to have their books in chronological order, some by color. Like I saw the most exciting thing. I've seen two things that I still want to do one day just to let you know what a geek I am. One of them I want to do is um, I want a Christmas tree out of books. Have you all seen it? It's like on Pinterest or someplace else, but it's a, it's a Christmas tree out of books. And the other is a desk out of books. And I'm considering how many books I have. That could be a very inexpensive option for me instead of that $700 desk that I bought from Ikea. Uh, 